Statesville cleaning up damage from a late afternoon storm that moved through parts of Wichita. Strong winds brought part of this fireworks tent down. This is at 159th Street and East Kellogg. This is in Andover, 33,000 square foot tent. It was rated for winds of up to 125 miles per hour, according to its owner, but could not stand up to this evening's wind gust. It flew uh, about 100 feet before landing in a field. Now, fortunately, nobody was seriously injured. I think we got lucky the tent didn't fall down. It flipped over. Uh, so I think we got very lucky there that it didn't, you know, it was it was crazy. There was a tent there, then there was no tent there, and you could just see everyone standing. It was, uh, we were very, very lucky how that happened and that everyone got out safe. Uh, he says all of their fireworks uh, were destroyed, but they do have backups uh, and a new tent, he says, is already on the way. He expects to be able to reopen by 9.30 or 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. Rain and strong wind caused damage in several counties. Take a look. This is from the area of 13th in Indiana in North Wichita. Part of a massive tree brought down. And check this one out, sent in by Ron Johnson. It shows a tree branch that broke off, nearly missing, breaking that window to his house. This is in Park City. And this photo, perfectly timed, captures lightning striking. Michelle Armstrong captured.